Harvey, you. thank God you're all right. I'm just glad you're still in one piece. Thanks for making it back to me. Huh. Nice driving back there. You know, if you'd swerved a little more, you would have actually hit me. Dang. <laughs> I'll make sure not to miss next time. What the hell's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings! When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. You really want to know? Then ask her. She won't even make eye contact with me. That's an order! How fucking dare you! What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Tell him. What the fuck is this? Javi! David, I thought you were dead. We were together in that van for years, David. I mean, years! You, you shouldn't be so surprised. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means! David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself, brother? David! Stop it! I love you! No. No, you don't get to say that! Jesus Christ, stop! How fucking dare That's you! That's enough! You're not taking my family from me! David, no! You stop! Ah. Fucking asshole! Fuck you! Guys, stop! That's enough! Both of you, stop! Dad, no! Steve! Oh my god! I'm gonna fucking kill you! David. Poor Gabe. I can't imagine. I had to do the same thing to Pa after he turned. Oh my god, that's right. Oh, Javi, I'm sorry. He talked about this every day. What to do when he died. He was convinced it would happen in the field. Every day. As common as talking about the weather. Not surprising. 
He was a soldier. I used to hate talking about it, but it seemed to soothe him. He'd talk about his military funeral the way that other people talked about retirement plans. He'd only change the subject if I promised I'd bury these. He didn't care about burying his body. As far as he was concerned, this was him. Help me dig. It doesn't have to be much. We should probably say something. That's what you do. Usually. When you see Pa, you tell him I said hi. And then I'm sorry for not paying you back that ten bucks. Do you, uh, you want to say something? Let's go. It was his own fault. If you regret helping me, if you're feeling any guilt, bury it. I mean it. We need to move on. Move forward. We do. And we will. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. We'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. <laughs>